3M Tegaderm CHG, Chlohexidine Gluconate, IV Securement Dressing 1657R, Application Demonstration for Peritoneal Dialysis. Always follow instructions given by the renal clinic, including hand washing and dialysis instructions. To apply a new dressing, first, wash or sanitize your hands. Cleanse the skin according to instructions given by renal clinic. Assess the exit site. The site should be observed daily for signs of infection or other complications. If you experience fever, pain, redness, swelling, or unusual odor or discharge, visible ooze or crusty buildup around the tubing, contact the renal clinic and follow their instructions. Ensure the skin around the exit site is completely dry before moving to the next step. Your renal clinic has recommended 3M Tegaderm CHG to help reduce infection risk. CHG stands for Clohexidine Gluconate. It is an antimicrobial and antifungal antiseptic that is contained in the gel part of your Tegaderm CHG dressing. The CHG provides antimicrobial protection by helping to prevent germs from growing on the skin around your catheter or medical device. Open package and remove sterile dressing. Handle the dressing by holding the sides. Do not touch any part of the dressing that sticks to the skin. Peel back the liner from the dressing, exposing the adhesive surface. The notch opening of the dressing should be positioned towards the external tubing, away from the exit site. Center the dressing with the CHG gel pad over the exit site. Gently lay the dressing down and ensure that the gel pad completely surrounds the exit site of the tubing. Avoid stretching the dressing during application to reduce the risk of skin trauma. Apply gentle pressure to ensure good contact between the gel pad and the exit site and tubing. Apply gentle pressure to the rest of the dressing. Work the dressing with the notch opening around and underneath the tubing and secure it to the skin. Slowly remove the paper frame while smoothing down the dressing edges. Apply the large notched securement tape strip underneath the tubing and over the top of the main dressing. Ensure the dressing is securely attached to the skin and tubing. Smooth down the surface of the dressing and around the borders. Enter today's date on the date tape and place it on top of the dressing. Inspect the dressing every day. This is very important to make sure you are protected from skin irritation and possible infection. Remember to cover and protect your dressing when showering. The dressing can remain for up to 7 days. However, the dressing may need to be replaced before it is due. If the dressing is visibly dirty or wet, contact the renal clinic for guidance to determine the need for a dressing change. You should replace a dressing when the border has lifted all the way to the transparent window. If the dressing is lifting just a little, you may reinforce with extra tape as shown. The gel is designed to absorb fluid. However, it can become saturated from showering, profuse sweating, bleeding, or oozing from the site. It is very important to look for this every day to avoid irritated skin. To assess gel pad saturation, use one finger to press down on the gel pad. If it stays indented and does not bounce back, contact the renal clinic for guidance regarding the dressing change. To remove the old dressing, there's a perforation down the center of the securement tape underneath the tubing. 
Use both hands to tear apart down the center of this curement tape. Hold and support the tubing and slowly remove the notch end of the dressing from the skin. Slowly pull back the dressing using a low and slow technique. Avoid skin trauma by peeling the dressing back, rather than pulling it up from the skin. When the gel pad is exposed, grasp a corner of the gel pad in the transparent film dressing between thumb and finger. Continue to remove the dressing low and slow while supporting the skin until dressing is completely removed, then discard. Use alcohol wipes or saline to facilitate the removal of the gel pad if necessary. If you're not sure if the dressing should be changed, please contact the renal clinic. This concludes the demonstration for 3M Tegaderm CHD Clohexidine Gluconate IV Securement Dressing 1657R for peritoneal dialysis.